they left a lot of stuff here. I had that car when I was a kid right here. <laughs> like a computer. What car? This little Hot Wheels car. Oh, really? Yeah. It's called the Flat Out 442. You know, some Hot Wheels are worth a lot of money. They might be worth some money right there. Was there anybody in here like when you guys came? Nobody was in here, but you never know. Yeah, we probably got market somewhere. Holy moly! Cannot believe they left all this stuff here. No way! Look at all this Play-Doh. Oh, it's actually yeah, in really good condition one. too. Man, this is awesome! Look at that. Not sure if anybody's done this. You know, while playing with Play-Doh, but I, I used to eat Play-Doh. Uh, 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 Tasted good. Uh, 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 all right, it's. This is like a kid's hat. What the hell's that? Is that you, Joe? No. What the hell is this noise? Dude, this no there's like a noise coming from the refrigerator. I just heard a door. Bro, this is... This is scary. Did that ever happen when you guys were here? No, man. But you know what? Look at this thing. It's locked up, bro. What the hell is that doing? Is there somebody in there? That's what I was thinking. Dude, that door started like moving too on its own. Are you serious? Yeah. Bro, I told you this place is so haunted, man. Is that hooked up or something? It is hooked up. Why would somebody have in a house that's abandoned? This fridge, like, on. Is there somebody in this fridge? Dude, what if there's a body bro, in here? About that? Bro, the last few times we were here, bro, that did not make a noise. Really? Joe and Todd have been here. They've been here, like, what, three times? Yeah. What if there's somebody in here? That's the freakiest thing ever, man. Hello? It stopped. Just like that. I swear, I thought you were doing that. I thought it was Joe too. Yeah, I was in the garage. I actually, I thought I bumped into something. I didn't know what that was. Bro, what, if there's, what if there's somebody in this freaking yeah, place? So that's not the thing I'm doing. Bro, you but if they're in there, they can't be alive. You want to try to open? Oh, yo, what was that? I don't even know. What is up with this place, bro? Like, where, where did you bring me to? What is this? Bro, you go to all these haunted locations, man. All right, so this place is so freaking haunted. Okay, I'll, I'll tell you some of the backstory here in a second but the pe the people legit left everything in this house behind i mean there's old vhs tapes i mean there's a lot of antiques here i mean this this place is loaded with stuff i mean books there's even cell phones that have been left behind it's like they didn't waste any time just to get out of here i mean look there's a coat hanger there with their coat still on it i mean this is insane look at this garage it's filled with stuff i mean why didn't the people come and pick this stuff up i'll tell you why because they did not want to come back in here because this place had some kind of demon attached to it. I mean, there's so much stuff in here. I guess Joe didn't explore in the garage here much. I mean, there's some pots and pans here. Some mag what kind of magazines are these? I mean, this is old. This place has been abandoned for such a long time. What does it say? 1993. What the heck? I mean, look at this old portable phone. Ooh, I mean, check out this old credit card too and look at the expiration date on it. 1995 is the expiration date. Let's get to the story now. And I did kind of share a little bit of this place in my vlog. If you're not following my vlog channel, I encourage you to go check it out because I do some explore videos on my vlog channel and I do do some behind the scenes kind of like I did. So if you're a follower of my vlog channel, just want to thank you so much. You are a fan of mine. But anyway, a lot of things have happened here. This place has a very dark past. Sometimes we come to these places based on what we hear. Now we had a subscriber reach out to us and they're like, you know, hey, go check out this place. It's, you know, about five or six hours away from your house. It'd be worth the trip, I promise. It's really, really haunted and the place is cool because, I mean, as you can see, they left everything behind. This place was that haunted and that under attack by spirits that they just up and left it. So what we were told 
is that there was a murder that took place here. It was a father, and I guess their son had went away to college, and he had some young children living here. Now, some of the mattresses, which is really crazy, are missing in some of the bedrooms where I guess they were murdered in the middle of the night by the father. He ended up committing suicide. Um, don't quote me on that. I have to find out if that's true or not. But that's the story, and I'm not sure if that's why this place is so haunted. I'm pretty sure all that was left was the son that was away from college, and he didn't want to come back here, so the place has been vacant ever since for the last 10 years or so. I think maybe even longer than that. I mean, there's a lot of stuff here pointing to this place being abandoned like in the 1990s. There's so much stuff in here. Oh, this is cool. Look, that's to wash hair. This was like a little hair salon. What is this? Oh, oh, that's so cool. That's uh, for a microscope. This place is really haunted. Let me know if you see or hear anything. This place is also really big. So the chances of running into Joe and Todd are very, very slim. I mean, I might run into them, but... Are you there, Todd? Yeah. Okay. Well, I heard something like back here. It's trippy, right? Shh, shh, shh. Listen to the door. But the door is just moving on its own right now. Where's Joe? He's back there. Oh, he's back there? There's nobody else here other than us. Unless maybe there's a homeless person like. Did that, but I don't know. I see somebody tried to break in here. Close. Now, I hear there's like three fireplaces, so that's one of them right there. The treadmill, there's a foosball table. I mean, they really left everything. Look at these old VHS tapes. All this stuff too, I mean, man, there's a lot. There's an old PlayStation. That's the original PlayStation, PlayStation 1. If you ever come to a haunted house like this, that has a lot of spiritual attachments, meaning this place was that haunted that they up and left, something horrible happened here too, I wouldn't take or suggest taking anything from it. I mean, even if, what was that? Why was there a beep? What closet? There's a closet? Oh, that's, that was weird. This place is giving me a headache. I don't know if it's from, Oh, okay, that's probably why. Oh, look, there's some old Easter baskets up there, which is really strange. We heard two stories on this place, Omar. One is, is that... I heard about the father. Right, that's one theory, that the father killed the family. Yeah. But there's also another uh, story that was told to us. We don't know which one's true or not. I haven't heard this story yet, so... All right, let's go. So, we also heard that actually robbers may have broken into this house and killed the family as well. Oh, so it was a home invasion. It might have been a home invasion. Now, there's two stories. There's two stories that come up in this area, but you know they don't publish the address. So, yeah. I'm not sure. But what I do know, man, this place is haunted, bro. It, I was just back there. I could hear a woman talking to me. And then one of the um, you heard a woman talking to you? I heard a oh, is that is that this this house where you where you had a whole sentence? 
Was that this house? This house, we picked up all kinds of voices, but it was just in the back in the master bedroom. You should check it out, bro. I heard a woman talking in there, and then uh, this shelf just fell over behind me, bro. Are you serious? That happened just right now. That happened right now? Just now, bro. What the heck? Yeah, so you y'all want to split up and see what we capture? Yeah. That'd be cool. I felt something in, in here. Did you? And then the door opened all by itself right, right out there. Bro. Like it was it was closed and I turned around and it was open just like that and then the, the other door started moving up I mean, I don't know. Maybe it could have been the wind. I'm not I ruling that it's out the wind, man. There's no wind out tonight. Check this out Look at the old VHS tapes There's beer boys. <laughs> oh, yeah, look some corona light So this is like a like a little bar pills i'm not sure what kind of medicine that is but you want some 10 year old pecans i'm down oh look at these old pickles what the heck i wonder if they're still good hey my favorite cereal cinnamon toast crunch somebody really loved pickles living here they took the mattress out because somebody was murdered on that mattress hey, look at that ginormous light switch Dude, how is the power still on? I didn't know the power was on. I guess it makes sense because the refrigerator was making that tapping noise. There was nobody inside that refrigerator. I mean, I don't know. Haunted refrigerator at 3 a.m.? Dude, look at this. They even, even left the glasses behind. I mean, there's so much. The kids left their clothes in there. This is this is insane. Shoes still here. What the heck here for you and sync fans? What? Check it out. There goes Lance. All right, you may think that I'm a fan, but I mean Justin Timberlake's my dude. Look at this cute elephant. I used to be able to look at that. These used to be really popular, like in the. I, I don't know. I don't really see them too much anymore. But what you do is you got kind of cross your eyes. You have to stare at it for a while, and then an image will kind of pop out at you. I'm gonna. Let's see if I can. Okay, it's not working. Did you hear any voices in here or no? Um, not that I, I've heard already. I've heard some noises. Yeah, but that door was creaking, bro. Like, yeah, it was. Man. Where did you guys catch that? I'm I'll throw in this back room. I'll show you where we were. Okay, we're gonna. And then, uh, so I guess something fell on Joe. Back here. Oh, dude, is that blood? Oh, bro, there is blood. Oh, no, wait, no, maybe that's the design of the carpet. I maybe. Know. It's hard to tell. I don't, think it's blood. I don't know. It doesn't look like a design. Or, I mean, maybe it is. It looks like blood. Though. It looks like blood. You heard that? <laughs> there was a freaking growl, bro. Dude, you heard? We all caught that. We all caught that. Dude, Yo, we just all... I swear to God, something... Like looked at me in this bathroom right now. We heard a growl right now, and then I looked in the corner of my eye, and there was something in here. This is freaking me out. Where did that happen? To the right. It was in here. Yeah. Is is this bathroom connected to there? No. Because something was in here. Right there, where that extension cord is, bro. Back there is where something fell. And if you're quiet in there, just walk around, you'll hear a woman talking. Really? Maybe it was a woman that was murdered here. It's a white figure. And I looked at me and then went back in here. Hello? Are you sure nobody's living in here? There's nobody living in here right yet. Is there any spirits in here? Someone totally answered him back when you said hello. Someone said hello. Really? Yeah. I thought I heard something, but I didn't catch it. I didn't make it out really good. Right when you said it, they said hello. I feel definitely uneasy here, like kind of dizzy, disoriented a bit, and I have a headache, like, and I, I don't get that very often. There's a, an extension cord running to the attic, man. Somebody could be up there, seriously. What? Look at that. Do you think somebody's running power up there? I mean, there is an extension cord. I don't know why that is. Alright, I'm gonna How go. How would they get up there? Like? I'm gonna go in here. Alright, bro. Just when you're in there, bro, be quiet because you'll hear voices. If you stand near that fireplace, mm -hmm. you'll hear voices. And then there's a hallway back there. 
and there you'll see like a little wooden shelf. Dude, I walked past it, the thing toppled over behind me. Really? Yeah, just be careful, bro. If those murders did take place, one definitely happened in, happened in here. If you, you heard a woman, didn't you? Dude, right. Maybe the wife here. was murdered here. It's possible, man. All right, find out. All right, good luck, brother. I don't know your name, but I did see you. Are you trying to, are you trying to show us something? So the mattress in this room is still here. And the door was like banging. What door? The door that came in. It was like bang, bang, bang. Really? Yeah. That door that we came in was like banging. It was like bang, bang. Yeah, I heard that too, man. Dude, that's true. All right, Todd wanted to go over there right now and he got a little spooked out. Oh, this is so cool. Look at this chest. This is beautiful. It's even got stuff in it. Look. Brand new pair of pants, size 10. Hello? No freaking way. All right, no, I'm not crazy. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys heard that laugh. Hello? Is that coming from the fireplace? Hello? Is that what looking at? Are you guys laughing or something? No, bro. Dude, I heard a laugh twice. Twice. Yeah, I'm telling you. One came from where you guys are at, and then one came from inside here. Bro, this is the thing that fell over before right here. I was in here, and this thing came popping over. Are you serious? Now, look, it's, 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 you know, sturdy. But you know I have a theory. If you come back here, right, this is broken out. Uh-huh. That could be where possibly maybe somebody came to the house. Oh, okay. Look, that window's broken. Right. They could have entered into here. So maybe it was a home invasion. Everybody. Well, why why do that when you could go right through the doggy door? It's big enough. <laughs> that was like big enough for a Great Dane or something. There's like hair products still here and yeah, man. look at that. I haven't seen one of those in years. Wireless headset, like the Sony Walkman headset. Oh yeah. There you go, man. Next time you go to the gym, brother, you you got the hookup. You good, man? I, I, don't, I don't know. <laughs> Like I got two stations on this thing. Hey, look, an old iPod. No way, Is bro. You could you could give this to somebody for Christmas. Look at that. Look at that. All right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big iPod right there, brother. It is. Hey, look at this. What size shoe, are you, bro? We you have you covered. Oh, you're good, man. You got at least one time? shoe. Yeah, man. I, I mean, those those are those like some golfing shoes or something. Yeah. Or bowl, uh, no, they're definitely not bowling shoes. You know what? This Dude, this is a bro. This is a Fendi bag. Yeah, Fendi. Wait, I don't know. I could be wrong. Yeah, Fendi. It is Fendi. Yeah. Oh, that's a Fendi bag. These are so expensive. Are they really? Yeah. Dang. Like you know, high end purses. They literally left every. Look, there's more stuff in here. Yeah. Maybe because it just has bad juju. What is in there? What is? Oh, oh that, that's, you're right, bro. There's a hot tub, like one of those '70s retro. Oh, cool. Damn, check this out. What kind of bag is that? Frankie and Johnny? Oh, that's a weird looking bag. I'm not even sure what that is. I guarantee you everything in this house. Like if I were to just take this home, like my house would be home. Because, I mean, I don't know, spirits, they have attachments. You know what I mean, whoever is in this house haunted or whatever is in this house haunting this house, it can attach itself to anything. That's why it's, I don't know. Just burn it. Definitely a cool house, though.
Hello? I heard a noise in there. Dude, I saw somebody in the mirror right now, I swear to God. Dude, there was somebody in this mirror right now. They were, it was like they were right next to me. Were you guys in here at all? No, bro, I just walked right in right now. I, just, you know, I, I don't know, maybe it was just a reflection. Maybe it was just me. I don't even know if I if I caught it. I look at the corner of my eye and I seen somebody standing in here with me. It's weird because when you did that, I thought I heard something behind me as well. You okay, bro? Yeah. <clears throat> Man, I'm telling you, this place is bad juju. Seriously. I feel like there's a woman in here. I don't know if it was a woman that I saw, but I saw a figure, and it was really tall. And it was right, it was standing right next to me. I think it was either here, or I don't even remember. It's hard to tell, because when you're looking in the mirror, you don't, you know what I mean? It's the backward side, so. It was right next to me, though. I think it was over here. It was right here. Yeah, it was oh, right man. behind me. Something about this place. Bro, I don't, I don't think we should be here anymore. Yeah, maybe we should get outside. Yeah. Did my camera keep shutting up, bro? Does it? And at least three or four times in this place tonight, man, I heard a woman behind me, bro. What? Oh. Did you hear that? I'm sorry. Dude, I heard that too. Dude, this is, I'm thinking this is the most haunted, like, part of the house. What's up with this random chair? In the closet like that. It's so weird. I'm gonna show you the outside of this place. I kind of started this video like not showing you the outside, but I'm gonna show you the outside. I guess there's two jaguars. <coughs> not the cats, but you know the cars. And they're outside and they're abandoned too. Like nice cars. Look at all the stuff they left in here too. This is insane. Oh, Joe is talking to it. He's talking to the spirit right now. Dude, I'm telling you, that, that's the hot spot is in that room right there. You know what? If it's a woman spirit, you know, she could be trying to seduce you. You know what I mean? I ain't. Exactly. Well, I do have my sexy shirt on and whatnot. <laughs> Joe is looking pretty sexy. She's like, I want to get down with that. <laughs> Dang, there's even stuff outside. What's up with all these walkers over here? Dang, that's so cool and creepy. Like abandoned walkers. I mean, was this place like a nursing home at one point? People were saying, like, what I think most theories were is that they use them to, like, melt, like, take the metal. Oh, from the metal. Stuff. Yeah. Um, that does make sense. Yeah, they can make other things with it. Oh, you ain't lying. Now there is a car there. Yo, bro, there's two of these here. Two of these? Yeah, identical cars. Dang. So I guess the other Jaguar is a little bit further up. There's a huge property. Dang. That's the Shaguar, baby. Look at that. Bro, it's a nice car, right? I mean, you could sell this for parts alone, like the seats and stuff. Yeah. Do I make you horny, baby? Do I? Do I make you randy? Yeah. Oh, behave. Oh, behave. <laughs> Omar's going to awesome come power. rolling up in this tomorrow. Don't let him fool you. This is going to be his new ride. This is my ride. You ain't lying. I'm going to be like, hey, Omar, what are we doing today? He's like, I don't know, baby. We're going out with Shagwa, man. Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm getting the little battery thing showing up on my camera like my camera's about to die legit but i just wanted to give you a quick update on that house that we visited i saw a creature twice in that house i'm not sure if i got any footage of it but i'm gonna go back and see my footage it was it was pretty crazy i'm actually pretty tired i'm exhausted i have a headache there was something in this house that i have never felt before on any exploration also if you didn't know i have a merch site that you can be a part of if you want to get your kids some merch some oh my gosh merch for christmas i also added some gimme kiss swag to the kids section i know a lot of you've been complaining like you know hey the little kids section is kind of limited well i added the gimme kiss logo to that which is my top selling logo on teespring so be sure to check it out big shout out to my friends joe and todd for taking me along on this exploration it was a lot of fun hope you enjoyed today's video gotta go for now before we leave Give me a kiss. Peace.